Why is this dude still here? Commander! Huh? What do we do next? Next? <laughs> we join their forces. Hey, we can't just sit around here doing nothing. We all want to be doing something, anything, but we don't have any clue where to go next. We don't even know what Nevik is up to. Or what Yuri is up to. Mm -hmm. Good juice spot. Mm. That was a There is still one lead available. That is a ju that was a juice spot. This That's place might be worth checking out. These are the canyons. Right. We passed through these canyons before. But there's also a subterranean area down below. Huh? What do you mean? Well, depending on the filters you lay on it, a map can reveal more than it does at first glance. And right here. It's well hidden, but there's a sizable thermal energy deposit in the lower canyon area. A deposit? Five years ago, a processing a plant down there was shut down and abandoned for some reason. There's enough thermal energy there to supply Nevik for years. If it's been left untouched this whole time, it'll provide a good jump start for the Frontier Project. It's just a hunch. But if your hunch is right, Wayne, let's check it out. Yeah. You mean me, not you. So let's just get that straight. <laughs> let's just get that straight right now. Alright? Let's get the sword. Let's get the thermal sword. Yeah. I forget what. You have to find a way underground. Or we won't be going anywhere. Yeah, we. I remember we have to go to a volcano facility. Always gotta check under those trucks. Hope you guys can hear me now. Let me know if you can't, or is if it's better. But yeah. Uh, yeah. No. Headshot, there we go. There. Let's see here. 
first let's activate this hole so we get our thermal energy up from the one that's numero uno guys always have thermal energy uh, what we got here? No, no. Oh! Get that back, let me get the sniper. Snipe, dude. We gotta take out those turrets. What's funny is, if you if you're able to get a come on, if you're able to get a headshot. Oh, snap. If you're able to get a headshot on those rocket turrets. Pop the guy. There you go. Just like that, and we're back in action. Now, let's see if I can. Let's see if I can do some damage with the drop. Oh! And that's how the cookie crumbles. Lots and lots of headshots. Hey, then. So. so. Our goal is to get to this garage because there is a mech inside. Two mechs. Ah. Okay. Let me just drop. Yay! Ah! Spooky music's just happening. thing about unlimited ammo that's really nice. Guess 
try this one. I like the faster ones anyway. ATSD shit. Oh, I'm up. Okay, there we go. Let's take go. Laser gun better is better because ammo. That's just my opinion though. Then we'll get the double machine gun. Get even more ammo. It's nice. Ready. I don't have to find any more. Yes. 
right now he's stuck on the bridge. We can't see this. <laughs> oh man. He's still trying to shoot at us. Let's take whatever life on this back there left. Like I said, I haven't played this game in years, so I don't remember what this level is. I'm gonna trade up with this shot. Okay, shotgun. Now, game mechanic you guys is notice how this hole in the wall is very small that means you wanted to proceed with a titan or sorry a, a vs mech whatever you want to call it this basically prevents you from doing it so a little bit of gameplay technology yeah oh my god crap all right Stay away from the octopus. Oh, I remember this mission. I remember the boss now. It's a good boss. Get to it. Since this thing has little wings on it, you can dash. and machine gun.
Oh my god. Just like that, we have a new mech. Beautiful, right? Beautiful. Beautiful. Boom. Uh, left side. And here we go. Here we go. Hello. I think the boss fight is right around the corner if I, if I remember from however many years ago that I left. Spider Boy. Spider Boy mech. I'm not gonna use that. Maybe next. Ow. Now you can see. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. It's a boss fight. Oh, see any of you. Now y'all. Check. Boss out. I remember when I first played this, it was crazy.
fear of spiders. Like I knew how to play this game. Oh my god. Then we just, just pop it. Pop it like a chuck. There you go. Oh, I'm gonna take like 20 minutes. 10, 30 times. You know, like that bad. 20, 24 minutes, there you go. Now to the unskilled player. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it'll be the <laughs> Hopefully it'll be the same time. Hopefully. Joe sure put us through a whole lot of trouble. Wait, he's not here. What? When did he disappear? <gasps> oh shit. Nice try. But things like that will get you killed, brother. Bendero. I was curious. I had to see the latest harmonizer model for myself. Shut up! <laughs> What a waste to give it to someone like you. Huh. Oh, my leg. <laughs> there are far too many modified humans in this world for my taste. Ooh. There we go. Son of a You never said anything about killing them. Change of plans. <laughs> On whose authority? Yours? Eisenberg's plan was to keep them distracted while he started up the frontier system. Yeah. The warming would bring about the end of the acred and transform this into a green paradise. Then when they saw the result, they would come to see the light. The only green fields you'll be seeing are the Elysian variety. Jeez. What? Seeing as how nothing will be left alive on this rock once the frontier system is set into motion, all this talk of heating the planet is only after all life has been exterminated. That can't be. Now. Harbingers of a new tomorrow. A message for us officers. I'll let you listen to this one. Oh. For 150 years, colonists have endured the unpredictable conditions of this planet. Endless battles against the mysterious Acred. The Separatists, who have formed the Snow Pirates and dog our every step with constant violence. But now, the Frontier System will deliver us from our tormentors. Clean energy will set it into motion and rid us of the acrid and other unpleasant elements plaguing this world. The acrid eradication will also provide a release of thermal energy 
that will serve to heat the atmosphere. <laughs> Unpleasant elements. That must sting. While the system is running, we ask that you proceed to the orbital elevator and initiate the hibernation process. The facility there will protect you from the energy output by the system. Once the world has been terraformed, you will be the first to witness the verdant utopia that Looks awaits. good. Hmm. It looks like it'll do. Hmm. Well, I'll make it do. Big ass snipe. This third of the colonial planets will be transformed into a paradise, welcoming colonists from our polluted home planet with open arms. The valuable resources lying untapped, hidden under layers of ice, will not only bring prosperity to Nevik, but to the human race. We are the pioneers exploring the wonders of this brave new world. Hey, you better be listening to this. It's time to proceed <laughs> to the orbital elevator. Enjoy a pleasant rest. We will soon meet again, brave pioneers. He's like, I'm losing blood here. Oh, okay. Heard enough? We are near the time of our parting. Sorry, it won't happen again. <laughs> 